Sandra, we were watching as the first pictures started trickling in from this remote part of New Mexico, and it was obvious straight away that this was a major incident, and many were likely to be killed and injured. The front of the bus was essentially ripped off completely. Forty-nine people were on board. It had left Albuquerque yesterday afternoon, heading ultimately here to L.A. But about two hours into the journey, this horrific scene unfolded. Other the drivers who were on I-40 at the time jumped out of their vehicles and became, in essence, first responders. Listen here. There was a lot of people with injuries. It was all the way from the most minor to the most severe, which you can only imagine what most severe could be. So it was going from that. It was a lot of screaming and yelling and a lot of people in need and just going to anybody for help. Seven people confirmed dead, as you said, Sandra. Several are still in local hospitals in New Mexico. We do not have a number on how many of those are in critical condition, Sandra. And Jonathan, there is an investigation underway. Yeah, the NTSB, National Transportation Safety Board, uh, immediately activated a GO team. They're due to arrive at the crash scene sometime this morning. Police obviously have already been investigating. They say that they believe that the big rig blew a tire. Uh, the driver of the big rig, who actually survived, also told police that. Um, but even before that informal investigation got underway, officials Officials were simply trying to ID the dead and the injured. Listen here. It's going to take investigators quite a while to go through and actually identify who was sitting where and who were the drivers and who were the passengers. Greyhound put out a statement in which they said, in part, quote, we are fully cooperating with local authorities and will also complete an investigation of our own. A genuinely horrific scene on I-40, Sandra. And in some ways, when you look at those pictures, it is a miracle that many more people on board that bus were not killed. Thank goodness. Sandra?